Hey guys, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert your MP3 files to open source formats. So to start off, you need to install the Sound Converter app. Now I am on Arch, so I'm going to quickly get this app installed. But there are instructions on how to get it on uh, every distribution. Once you've got it installed, which I have it installed now, we need to launch the app. And uh, from here, we need to go to the settings area, go to preferences, and we need to choose our format. So in this video, I'm going to go with OGG, Og Vorbis. Uh, you can also go with Opus. In my article, I go over both, but we're going to do Og. So as you can see, I've already set it uh, to a convert folder. But just to show you how this all works, you need to open up the you need to select into folder then click choose and then set up a folder and we can do uh, create new folder converted audio click open and now it's going to send all of our converted files there we can click close now from here we can send our files uh, I have stuff in my Dropbox folder we can send our files to the sound converter to convert everything so we can go to misc mp3s I have a bunch of tool stuff I'm going to convert the Let's see, the Lateralis album, one of my favorite albums. All we gotta do is drag it in here. You can also click the plus sign here or the folder icon here. From there, you just click the convert button. Now it's going to quickly convert all of my files to Opus. So I can go to converted audio, and as you can see, all of the files are slowly converting. Uh, I misspoke, I said Opus, I, I mean Aug. But I can also convert it to Opus if I wanted to. And now it's all done, and I can see my stuff. I can open up with uh, this uh, app here, and it's going to play. I'm going to turn it down, but it's in OGG, and it works. And it's a completely open source format. I don't have to worry about codecs. Now, the reason that uh, you should consider converting your audio files over is especially if you care about open source and you don't want to deal with any proprietary codecs. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick video on how to convert audio files to open source formats. I will see you in the next video.